Capacitive proximity switches are terminal switches. They detect electroconducting and non-conducting materials, solid, powdered or liquid. If the material is in a proper distance from the sensor, the sensor responds. Capacitive proximity switches comprise the following basic units. The generator secures the electrical field for the interaction with the object. The demodulator transforms the amplitude. Variation of the generator high frequency vibrations into the variation of the constant voltage. The trigger secures which in signal rate of rise and the hysteresis value. The intensifier increases the inlet signal to the necessary value. The light emitting diode indicates the condition of the switch, controls the efficiency and the adjustment operability. The compound provides necessary protection from the penetration of water and solid particles. The frame secures the mounting of the switch, protecting it from mechanical damage. The frame is made of brass or polyamide. It is replenished with hardware. Let us consider how the switches work. The active surface of the capacitive switch comprises two metallic electrodes, which may be called the facing of the unbound condenser. The electrodes are connected to the reactive circuit of the high-frequency self-contained generator, tuned in such a way as not to generate in the absence of the object in the proximity of the active surface. When approaching the active surface of the switch, the object enters the electric field and alters the reactive capacity. The generator starts to produce vibrations. The amplitude of the vibrations increases as the object approaches. Capacitive switches respond both to the electroconductive object and non-conductors. The fact that capacitive switches react to various objects makes it possible to use them in a wide range of spheres. They are most efficient when used to control the level of filling reservoirs and capacitors, signal the band ruptures, control the contents inside the package and the tear, count and position all sorts of objects. When using the switches, it is vital to protect yourself from false responses, which may be caused by precipitation, technological liquids, etc.